Now, I'm at Walmart, and as I was walking past this area, I seen some clearance tags. So I had to stop, you know I had to stop. And look at what I see here. This Jergens Glow for $2.49. And guess what? I bought us giving back $2, making it only 49 cents. Here is the SKU if you wanna look for it at your store. So yeah, I'm gonna pick one up. Now they also have this um, one right here. Um, I will get the medium to dark one if I was to get one. Well, it looked like, well, it says 30 MD 30, medium deep, I guess. I'm looking at this clearance tag right here, 569. It's a $2 pilly on there. And I bought us giving back $5. And there's no restriction for using coupons. So that'd be $7 off, leaving my final cost to be $3.69. But I don't even know if I want to spend that, y'all. But I'm going to keep looking over here. Let me see what else I can find, y'all. They, um, this Neutrogena over here, they don't have any on clearance, showing on clearance. But I know we got Ibotta rebates for these, too. Let me, let me, um, clip, let me, um, scan them on the Ibotta, um, app and see if anything attached. And sure enough, three dollars is attaching to this, making this only three two dollars and ninety eight cents. I don't know. I might have to pass on this. I, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I was hoping I can find. Well, I'm gonna keep looking because this is this store is good for having some good clearance. So let me keep browsing around. I'm gonna grab the U by Kotex. Their price at three fourteen a piece. I'm gonna pick up two. That's gonna bring my total to six dollars and twenty eight cents. Now, I bought it's going to give us back a dollar and fifty cent. Now, on Shop Meal, I have four dollars as well as Alexa. And on Swag Bucks, there's a four dollar when you purchase two rebate. Now, I'm going to pick up two. I didn't clip it yet, but when I get as soon as I check out, I'm going to submit my receipt. And I'm hoping that everything works out as I expect it to. So, I'll let you guys know. Okay, I'm in the clearance again, and I found this right here for two dollars. And I bought us giving back three, so I'm going to pick them up. All right, now the Glade here is priced at two dollars and twenty-eight cent. Um, trying to see what the difference between these prices are, but I'm gonna try to get the ones that's two dollars and twenty-eight cent. Okay, so I'm gonna get the Hawaiian Breeze and maybe the Clean Linen. Um, so that's gonna be four dollars, and what's that? Fifty-six cent. Now I'm going to submit to Ibotta for $1.50 back when you purchase two. I'm going to submit to ShopMem for $1.50 back as well as Alexa. Now on my swag bucks, I have $1.50 back there as well. But you all know how that's going to go. But even without the swag bucks, it's, it, will, it will be what free plus a, well, no, it actually be six cent. But I'll take that. I'm going to go grab two. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up this coffee made. It's priced at four twenty-six a piece. Um, I bought it's gonna give us back a dollar a piece for them for the seasonal ones, and each one of them attached to the rebate. So I'm gonna pick up these two. Um, Shop me is gonna give back two dollars as well as Alexa. Now on swag bucks, I got two dollars back, but I'm afraid that when I submit my receipt, I can catch it before they remove it. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some of these Keebler cookies. They're priced at three dollars and thirty-eight cents. I was hoping they were still gonna be on rollback. <laughs> And I bought us giving back a dollar and twenty-five cents. So I want to get them. I know my husband to eat these, so I'm gonna grab them. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of this beef. It's priced at a dollar and sixty-four cent. I bought us gonna give us back a dollar, and I have fifty-five cent on Shop Meal. I'm not sure if I have it on Alexa as well, but if I do have it on Alexa, it'll make it free plus a money maker. If I don't, it'll just be um, it'll be nine cent. So I'm gonna grab it. Now the Tasty Cakes here is priced at $1.78 and I bought us giving us back $0.45. Cent. I was looking for the box, um, the bigger box. I really didn't want to get these, but these will work. I can take them to work. Somebody will eat them with their coffee, so I'll grab these. I'm going to pick up some graham crackers for four sixty-eight. dollars They're expensive, boy. And I bought us giving back a dollar. This is something my um, we pack for my little girl every day, so why not? Now, I'm going to pick up this lemon pound cake. It's priced at $2.97. Um, I bought it's giving back $1.62. Okay, so that's going to leave my final cost to be $1.35. So I'm going to grab it. I normally make pound cake from scratch, but <laughs> I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to try it. 
Alrighty, now I am going to pick up some seasoning. Um, I think I'm just going to pick up this red jalapeno garlic. It's priced at um, $2.16. Now, I bought it. You got to pick up two to get $2.16 back. So it's going to make one of these free. So I'm going to pick up two. Why not? You know, we cook. <laughs> I season my meat, so you know, why not pick up some seasoning? <laughs> now these are my receipts. I picked up the pound cake, the lemon pound cake by mistake, and I had to return it and pick up the correct one. Now um, she gave me cash back to $2.97 in cash. So um, I purchased the correct vanilla pound cake, so be mindful of that. Um, the Cetaphil, I didn't go over that in the store. Um, it's priced at $8.97. I bought it, it's giving back $1.50. Shop Mim and Alexis have two dollars as well as swag bucks okay so that left my final cost to be a dollar and 47 cents so i also included that in my haul i paid before tax a total of 68 dollars and 74 cents i submitted my receipt to ibotta and got back 40 dollars and 98 cents which included my midweek money maker bonus of five dollars okay which is awesome um, mm -hmm. now swag bucks I submitted my receipt to swag bucks for a total of ten dollars and five cent it's still processing it's still pending under review or whatever but I was able to submit my receipt here are all the um, items that I submitted for total of ten dollars and five cent shop mem I submitted my receipt for ten dollars and five cent as well and it processed already I received the money my PayPal account I submitted for $7.50 to Alexa. The coffee mate isn't on Alexa for me or the little beef. I um, also had brand club surveys. $1.45 for Ame, $1.15 for the coffee mate, and $1.25 for the jerkins, which is a total of $3.85. Now that gave me back a grand total of $72.73. Now subtracting the total amount spent, which was $68.74 from the total amount received back, makes everything you see here completely free, plus a $3.69 money maker, okay? So yes, this is everything that I picked up. Now, what else? Um, the Ame. Now, I showed you guys I was going to originally just pick up one, but as I was walking through the store, I found another clearance area that had more. So, I just picked them all up, and they were all $2, giving a dollar back, giving $3 back on Ibotta, made them all free, plus a $5 money maker. So, that's why I maxed out that deal. Yeah, so, that helped towards the overage, which allowed this transaction to be free for me. So, yes, this is everything that I picked up. Now, if you have any questions regarding any of the items that you see in my haul, please do not hesitate to drop them in the comments below. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate your support. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. All right, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.